Here's another surprise for you. Evelyn Bonon has come up with her third recipe, actually using almost the same time and the same creativity that she has. Tell us about this third recipe, Evelyn. Okay, as I've um, showed you, we have the braised kale, okay? And I'm gonna transfer some of the kale in this uh, uh, nice plate and make a bed, a bed, bed for another dish. And this is the dish that I'm going to do for you, which is very quick, okay? And it's only, it has only three ingredients, okay? Egg, okay? Okay, we're gonna put some, we're gonna put some uh, breadcrumbs, okay? Breadcrumbs, okay? And some herbs, okay? So we just mix it together. If you want to put flour, you can too though. So you can use, uh, you can use it also, okay? But I'm not gonna put some flour right now, okay? Now what I'm gonna put is a little bit of cornstarch, okay, which is uh, gluten-free, okay? And I have my cornstarch here. Okay. Just a little bit of it, just to, to, to have a little crunch, okay? Okay, and so it will stick together. And I have the skillet or frying pan right now. I'm gonna remove my gloves and put some oil, okay? Just vegetable oil, not too much, okay? And uh, normally I don't season the, the, the shrimp because it has inherent, uh, inherent flavor in there, okay? so. I'm just gonna put the shrimp on the hot oil, okay? And you don't overcook the shrimp. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be, be rubbery, okay? Mm -hmm. So let's cook about five, because we're going to use the same dish to put this on top of the bed, uh, the kale bed, okay? So it means you have a nice place to serve to your family or to your guests. Okay, let me, uh, let me wash my hands quickly because once you touch the eggs, you have to wash your hands for food safety. Yes, okay? tell us about that. Right. Like, And, and also the use of utensils right, at the same right. time. That's yes. right, okay. Now what so, about the shrimp? Uh, how do you choose a good shrimp? The good shrimp, I use the nicest shrimp, like the colossal, the, the largest one, okay? So that's already cooked right now. Oh, that's and it tastes quick. about... It takes about like two, three minutes to cook the shrimp. You don't overcook it, but that makes sure it's cooked. Okay. So what's the proportion, Evelyn, of uh, the one egg that you use for how many uh, pieces of shrimp? Okay, this is about probably um, 16. I use one egg. Okay, uh, two tablespoons of cornstarch and uh, two tablespoons of um, um, the breadcrumbs. Okay, and this is done. It's How do you know when it's done? It's done when it's already opaque, it looks opaque, okay? Because the danger is if it's overcooked, it's, it's, stuck. Yeah. it's mm -hmm. really not good. And if it's, not, if it's raw, it's, it's uh, half you, uh, cooked. The shrimp it's can also... be eaten raw, right? Okay. It's, uh, yes, yeah. uh -huh. mm -hmm. it can be eaten raw. But one has to be careful, correct? That's right. Mm -hmm. Yep, and it's done. Okay. That's and done. what type of oil do you use, Evelyn? Uh, vegetable oil. For this type of cooking, you can dilute olive oil with vegetable oil, okay? Mm -hmm. Because I, as I told you, that olive oil cannot withstand very high temperature, mm -hmm. okay? So this is cooked, it's done. Wow. It's done, done, okay? No wonder you're so quick in the restaurant where you okay. <laughs> regularly go to cook yeah. all these recipes. And what you what create you wonders. What you can do is to put this on top. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then you, you already have a main dish. And the vegetable. Okay, so that's what I'm doing for Awi, and this is her. You can put two. Um, add number is um, add number is always nice. You know, like mm -hmm. don't put four, maybe three is better, five mm -hmm. is better. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you have that, and this is your dish. Okay, and we can put a. Um, uh, it's pretty important to garnish it if you don't have uh, other garnishes. Okay, all you have to do is just put this, okay, and you know, wow. you, can, you can look at that. Yeah, it's not nice. We'll get another one, okay? So that's a nice piece here, mm -hmm. okay. Fantastic, Evelyn. Yeah. Takes Beautiful. about uh, like five minutes to prepare it. Wow. 
but what you have is uh, a lifetime of passion. Right, yeah. You have to be very passionate about your undertaking. Like cooking, if you love cooking, you, you really have to love it. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Uh, one of a kind, Master Chef Evelyn Bonoan. Once again, uh, we are Barry saying goodbye for now. Thank you so much for watching. Until then.